All right, so let me see. So a while back, my friend Sarah introduced us to a um, game, and I'm gonna try to get the name right. I I believe it was Taco Cat Goat Cheese Pizza or something like that. Um, and it was a fun card game. And in fact, I remember the first time her and Mark and I played it. Um, you mean? Oh, and I'm a mess. I'm a hot mess. Okay, but I remember the first time Mark and I played it with her, and um, there were some injuries. But it was it. We had a blast playing. And so um, then we played Taco versus Burrito. I think it was or something like that. Um, and then it was when we were camping. And so then we started exploring the other games and. Um, Somewhere in the middle of all that, before we played the second game, I had done a Kickstarter for um, the same company, Exploding Kittens, for a game called Hand to Hand Wombat. Super excited about this, by the way. And in the meantime, I kept exploring their other games. Um, we played Hand to Hand Wombat. We played um, Exploding Kittens, of course. Um, what was a salmon one? There's a salmon one. Happy salmon, I think, or something like that. Oh my gosh, that one's great. Um, I highly recommend silent mode, especially if you have kids playing because it kind of levels the playing field out so that the kids get to play more. Um, anyway, great games, great concepts. They're new. Um, get people active and interacting. Um, fun, funny, just the things that happen. And they're unique. And they're usually relatively easy to learn, but lots of ways to complicate it later on if you want more of a challenge. Um, so with that, I got the box for the, um, the game. I did do the highest tier. Well, I mean, you could donate more, but I did the highest tier I needed to, to get into the beta test. Um, and unfortunately we did not do great at the beta test. Um, but it is what it is. So the, the company is just, they're an amazing company. They're fun. Obviously they like to have fun. I wonder what it's like to work there. It's got to be a ball. I, I hope it's a ball. I hope it's not like a complete opposite of what everything the game looks like it is. is. Anyway, so this box this has this little game in it. I, I mean, I, how big can the game be? Um, most of their games are, you know, shoe box size or smaller. Um, is huge. <laughs> I came home today. I'm like, oh my gosh. So I'm excited because they, they put in lots of extras and there's supposed to be some surprises in there. So we're going to unbox it. So here it is, exploding kittens. Because, you know, who wouldn't want exploding kittens? Okay, I'm going to grab some scissors here. Okay. Jeez, this box has seen better days. So I'm just saying. Um, I don't know what route you guys sent this from Middletown, Middletown PA. But my lord, it's had a day. So anyway, um, we're going to go ahead and unbox it. It's got my address on there. Congrats if you want to hunt down me and my exploding kittens to have at it. I don't have, I, th I don't think I have a follower, so I think I'm good. Okay, so let's see here. Okay. There's our supervisor, Tiggy. Tiggy, you supervising? This is the disaster for getting ready for Halloween. Look at that. Okay. Anyway, Tiggy's going to get down here and supervise because now he's like, ah, you got a box. Okay. Paper. They sent me paper. This is good. Maybe I'll keep score on it. I don't know. Okay. So, let's see. There's a note. We're so grateful that folks like you believe in us and our games. Um, hand hand Wombat is really special to us. It's social. It's physical. and silly as heck. Awesome. It'll bring people together. Oh, it brings people together in a very unique way. And we're so glad that you're ex you're as excited about it as we are. There's a lot of stuff in here. Um, Tiggy, you're not sure about that? Okay. Um, let's see. We put a lot of time, energy, and love into creating Hand to Hand Wombat. And thanks to you, we're able to make this game a reality. It's because of folks... It's because of you that folks everywhere can enjoy all the laughter and memories that this game was made for. Thanks for supporting Hand to Hand Wombat and helping to bring a little more joy into the world. Much love and gratitude, Exploding Kittens. And um, just so you know, that kitten is not fully intact. Okay, so let's see what's in here first. Well, there's a box here. There's a box. Oh my gosh, where do I start? Okay, 
Okay, I know what this is. This is the Wombat Adventure book. So this book is full of all of the, okay, so as they did the tiers and awarded more prizes, they kept adding to them and adding to them. They would, um, they would post up these adventures and the backers got to kind of vote and say which way they wanted the adventure to go. So this should be like a graphic novel kind of thing that we did kind of on Facebook. And so as each tier was reached, the story changed as people chose where the game was headed. I know, I, I just, my camera person needs slapped. I'm round. It's just ridiculous. Good help's hard to find. Okay. So, yeah, that should be a graphic novel, I'm guessing. Yep. Okay, so yeah, there's the story of the Wombat Tower and lots of little stories along the way and some fun. I'm sure some memories, blah, 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 blah. Okay, anyway. Suitable for framing or whatever. Okay, it's a book. The Game. Oh my God, I just saw what's on the bottom. Okay, um, The Game. Hand-to-hand -hand wombat. So everyone closes their eyes. Good wombats build towers. Bad wombats weck, weck them. Don't judge me. Wreck them. Vote out the bad wombats. So, yeah. So I'm kind of excited to see this one as well. This new game. So basically whatever it is, is everybody gets given a role kind of like in Clue, where you're a certain person in Clue, except your role in this game decides whether you're going to help build the towers or um, cause chaos and try to get the towers destroyed or whether you're going to, you know, it's like, are you a good wombat or are you a bad wombat? So, you know, you get to be each. And then at the end of each round, players have to uh, try to figure out who was who was good and who was bad. Some wombats can't talk. So, and it says three to six players, ages seven plus. It's kind of a party game. And each round takes about 15 minutes. Okay. So, let's look at the game. Now, the prototype was really interesting. I'd never seen a beta version of a game before. And it was really cool because it was, um, I put the camera down, sorry. You don't get to see me. Um, because it was like, uh, everything was just black foam, black and white foam and no labels and real simplest, simplistic. So, yep, a little fancier here. We got actual towers and the pretty rule books. And we need to talk about Wombats, a comic by Oatmeal. This is not required to play the game. Okay. Um, so there's the towers and the cards. All right, really cool. So we will have to have some get-togethers and play some games. I'm really excited about this. You know, I think this would be a really great idea for maybe some team building for a company or something. You know, if you wanted to do some team building, because just just because I know the background of the game and how it's played um, might be worth looking at. Grimly, are you helping them pack? Yeah. They got their Kong box today, so they got to unpack that. That's the little jingle bell you keep hearing. All right, I'm going to set the phone down again. Wow, that is a big game. Okay. Oh, get in there. Get, get. Oh my gosh. I cannot close this box. Okay, it's closed. All right. Next up, we have, and I'm not going to open this one. Um, we have Recipes for Disaster. This is the ultimate game collection in one box. 13 game recipes. Play wild remix versions of the classic game. Oh, 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 oh. I think... I think I ordered this one as an add-on for Exploding Kittens. I think I ordered this one. So that I can't remember if that was a if that was a prize or if I ordered that. I might have I might have ordered it because we got a discount. Includes wearable cone of shame. I think that's awesome. Because why not? If your cat has to do it, you should have to do it. Okay. <laughs> this This is a keychain. <laughs> so as the don't <laughs> Oh my gosh, that is hysterical. He was the size of a keychain. And as the donations got bigger, the keychain grew. And there was no limit to how big it could get. It says hand-to-hand -hand wombat keychain of untold size. Oh my gosh, he's so soft. He's. I don't know how big a real wombat is, but I'm thinking this dude might give it a run for his money. Let's... Oh, oh my gosh, he got bigger. I opened the... 
there was some suction going on there. Oh my God. <laughs> that is not a keychain. That is a pillow. Yeah, he, he they surpassed keychain here a little bit. So he's cute. Oh my gosh. Okay. So there's there's the keychain of untold size. And he is soft and squishy and so cute. Oh my gosh, I love him. Okay, and there's more. So let's see. This is all the other goodies that they sent. It is the Golden Wombat Fanny Pack. You heard it here first. Fanny Pack, because, yeah, I needed a Fanny Pack. Okay, let's see here. Hand to Hand Wombat Golden Pouch. Okay, you can call it a pouch. It's a fanny pack, and we all know it. Okay, hold on. So, yeah. Well, okay. Okay, okay. I guess we can call it a pouch if you want to. It, it, it's, yeah, it's a pouch. Okay, whatever. Um, so, let me unzip it. What's in here? Oop. Okay, let's see here. First up. I'm really hoping... Um, Sleep masks for playing the game instead of having to cover your eyes are in here. Open the battery cover with a Phillips screw. Okay, there's some, something with batteries and something that needed gel. What are these? Okay, these are little, um, I think it's a good wombat and a bad wombat. One's a little more uh, horny. I know I just said that. I'm sorry. One's got horns on it. I'm just, whatever. Okay. Hand-to-hand -hand wombat. This is, I think this is scenarios, like extra cards that you can add to your, like an expansion. You can add to your game. Let me see if I can open it. You can watch the kitten play while I wrestle with wombats. Okay. The golden wom- Oh my gosh! Oh, no. Uh-uh. Okay. So, yeah, it's the Golden Wombat Edition. And um, there's upgraded score and point trackers. I, I don't know if you can see this. So, this card changes. The picture changes from good to bad. And this one changes from good. They all do. Okay. So, these cards all change. But the back, they're fuzzy and golden. No way. That is so cool. Okay, so this was another award that they gave to the, um, the uh, what do you call them, the Kickstarter group as um, the donations went up helping kickstart the game. So sometimes you get like, what do you call those, like premiums? They give you better better premiums as you go up. So, so yeah, see, good wombat, naughty wombat. Good wombat. Naughty Wombat, it's under there. Okay, so that's what's in that one. Okay, so let's keep going. There should be a timer in here, I think. Yep, yep, yep. Ye old Wombat timer. So that should be like the however minute, many minute timer. I think it's three minute timer to time your game. And there's no batteries in it, so I'm sure. I'm going to say the stupidest thing I've... No, probably the second stupidest thing. I'm sure it makes some kind of sound. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I know, I know. Okay, um, what is this? Oh, like, a, okay, so like a tally place? Is this what these are for? Maybe that's where your wombats go so you can help keep score in your game. And I got my wish. Okay, I thought they might be including these if we got enough. These are the, oh my God, they're so cute. They're wombat paw masks to cover your face so you don't have to hold your hands over your eyes because the the initial game you had to hold your hand over your eyes to not see what you're doing but with the upgraded version you get and these again are super soft and silky but they're little wombat paws oh i love it i love it all right so um shout out to exploding kittens i have a i think i have a feather there oh it's just yellow thread um one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, six. So the full, full load of players. Um, I love the game. I really appreciate it. I, it, You guys were an excellent company to, to kickstart for. Um, 
I feel like the the prize the the award you gave versus what the donation was was just amazing. I mean, um, so if you want to want to get out there and I I've, I've done several Kickstarters. I usually have one or two going at any time. Um, I've enjoyed doing them. It's fun to see companies grow. Some of them were kind of frustrating, especially during COVID. But um, it's a fun way to get involved in some companies. Um, we did um, Odd Pieces was another one we did with some puzzles that are really kind of amazing. But um, Exploding Kittens, great company. Um, love, love, you, love how fun you guys are and how much you supported. These guys auctioned off a house for a dollar or five dollars or something crazy like that. Um, and um, a vase, a butt vase. Um, and just some other crazy stuff, some really valuable, some just cheap stuff during the Kickstarter campaign. So a lot of fun. They were a really fun company. So um, watch for them. Watch for them on Kickstarter. Um, go Get out there and support another business that's trying to do something fun. Um, who knows? Maybe you'll see Doomsday's on there someday. All right. 